I think I've got just the thing, actually, uh, because, uh, and, and it was Professor Richard Dawkins who, uh, who did this, um, put this kind of slight upon atheism, I suspect. He wants you all to be called brights, I guess because you're brighter than the rest of us. Yes. I wish, I really wish, I say in my book, he and Daniel Dennett, another great scientist and teacher, I really wish they hadn't done that, because I think it's wrong perhaps three ways. I mean, no one could say Father Lemaitre was stupid, for example. That's one thing. Two, um, if it was a test of, of intelligence, it would have the unpleasant suggestion that that's how society should be ordered. I mean, like the Brave New World concept of the Alpha and the Beta and down to the Epsilon and so forth, which is a, a sinister behaviorist uh, form of utopia. And the third is that it gratifies exactly the suspicion of many religious people um, that they're looked down upon and scorned by the pointy-headed intellectuals and so forth. And I, I obviously promise you that I don't do that even with the real lowbrows and slope heads uh, among them. <laughs> They're my fellow primates too. <laughs> Let me so I, I, I was going to finish. The real I, was going to, I was going to finish vicious, there. You know, I don't want to. I don't want to finish. Barely on evolved that. ones. <laughs> I don't want to finish on that bitchy. The ones note. whose eyes are so close together they could use a monocle. That's it. <laughs> are you saved? <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs>